13 Signs You Might Be Undervaluing Yourself and How to Reclaim Your Worth Imagine if the most powerful tool for living a meaningful and fulfilling life wasn't something you could buy, earn, or receive from someone else. What if it was already inside you, just waiting to be discovered and unleashed? This isn't a mind game, it's a reality gleaned from the wisdom of Stoicism, a philosophy that has guided countless people across generations to live with purpose, resilience, and serenity. Stoicism teaches that the key to a good life doesn't lie in external praise or material success, but in mastering the art of valuing yourself through virtues like wisdom, courage, justice, and temperance. It's a powerful reminder that no matter how chaotic and challenging the outside world may be, we always have within us a solid foundation for our own peace and happiness. Here are 13 signs you might be undervaluing yourself and how stoicism can help you reclaim your worth. 1. Settling for a job that doesn't fulfill you. You've probably asked yourself why you're stuck in a job that doesn't bring you joy or fulfillment. The answer often lies in fear and the comfort of familiarity, fear of change, fear of failure, and the ease of staying in what you know, even if it doesn't make you happy. This not only diminishes your self-worth, but also stifles your awareness of your true capabilities. Stoicism teaches that real value doesn't reside in external circumstances, but in how we respond to them. By accepting a job that doesn't satisfy you, you're inadvertently saying that external circumstances matter more than your internal strength. How to reclaim your worth? Ask yourself, does this job align with my values and goals? If not, it's time to reassess and take action to change your circumstances. This doesn't mean being reckless or self-blaming, but acknowledging and leveraging your inner power to create positive change. Remember, by taking control of your perception, judgment, and actions, you can escape this situation and open up new opportunities for growth and happiness. 2. Staying in unhealthy relationships Many people choose to stay in relationships that don't offer support or upliftment, sometimes out of fear of loneliness, sometimes believing they don't deserve better. These relationships not only weaken your spirit but also diminish your self-worth. Stoicism reminds us that our true value doesn't depend on others, but lies within ourselves. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, does this relationship truly reflect my values and self-respect? If not, it's time to make a change. Remember, by taking action, you're not just reclaiming your peace of mind but also fostering personal growth and seeking healthy relationships that truly value who you are. 3. Not Pursuing Your Dreams One of the most telling signs of undervaluing yourself is not pursuing your dreams and aspirations. Many people hold themselves back from stepping out of their comfort zone for fear of failure or because they don't believe in their abilities. Stoicism encourages us to recognize that our worth isn't impacted by external failure or success, but by the strength and determination to pursue what we believe in. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, does this dream reflect my values and goals? If so, don't let fear or comfort hold you back. Remember, pursuing your dreams isn't just about conquering a goal, but about a journey of self-discovery and growth. 4. Letting external circumstances define your value Many people believe that external circumstances, their job, relationships, or financial situation, determine their worth. This is a major misconception. Stoicism highlights that our true value lies in how we respond and handle those circumstances, not in the circumstances themselves. How to Reclaim Your Worth Remember, in the face of adversity, you always have control over your perception and actions. Don't let external circumstances dictate your worth. Ask yourself, am I responding to this situation in a way that aligns with my values and goals? If not, adjust your perspective and actions. This not only empowers you but reaffirms your inherent value in any circumstance. 
five, accepting less than you deserve. Often, we settle for less than what we deserve simply because we think external circumstances hold more power than we do. However, according to Stoicism, true worth isn't dictated by our surroundings, but by how we confront them. Accepting less than you deserve isn't just about enduring, it's about undervaluing your own capabilities and worth. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, am I living and acting in alignment with my own values? If not, it's time to shift your perspective and actions. Remember, don't let circumstances define your value. Stand up and claim your worth through every decision and action. 6. Ignoring alignment with your values We often fail to consider if our current situations reflect our true values. This leads to a life that isn't authentic, fulfilling, or aligned with who we are. Stoicism teaches that we should constantly ask ourselves if the situation we're in aligns with our values and goals. If not, it's time to act and make a change. It may be difficult, but it's essential for a meaningful and genuine life. Don't settle for what doesn't reflect your values. Live and act according to what you believe in and hold dear. How to reclaim your worth. Ask yourself, do my current circumstances align with my values and goals? If not, it's time to make a change. 7. Undervaluing your accomplishments. When we achieve success, we tend to attribute it to luck or assume it's something anyone could do. This not only diminishes the value of our achievements but also underplays the virtues and efforts we put in. Stoicism encourages us to assess our accomplishments accurately. How to reclaim your worth? Ask yourself, what virtues did I use to achieve this success? Perhaps it was courage, wisdom, or perseverance. Acknowledge and appreciate these virtues. It's not about arrogance, but about being honest with yourself. Remember, be proud of your efforts and achievements they are proof of your true value and capability. 8. Neglecting self-care Another clear sign of undervaluing yourself is consistently putting others' needs before your own, neglecting self-care. While this may feel selfless and heroic, it can lead to burnout, resentment, and a loss of self. Stoicism reminds us that self-care isn't a luxury, it's a necessity. How to reclaim your worth Ask yourself, am I taking care of myself enough to be able to support others better? If not, adjust the balance. Remember, self-care helps you maintain your mental and physical well-being, making you stronger to support and help others effectively. Don't let yourself become depleted. 9. Struggling to accept compliments Many people struggle to accept compliments, often viewing themselves through a distorted lens, focusing too much on flaws and neglecting their good qualities. Stoicism teaches that humility isn't about denying our strengths, but about acknowledging them truthfully and fairly. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, what did I do to deserve this compliment? Reflect on the virtues and efforts you've put in. Remember, Accepting a compliment is not about feeding your ego, but understanding and recognizing the parts of yourself that are capable and successful. See it as an opportunity to reaffirm and appreciate your value and efforts. 10. Hesitation in decision-making Another sign of undervaluing yourself is hesitation when making decisions. Many people feel paralyzed by choices, fearing they'll make the wrong one. Stoicism reminds us that no decision is perfect, and every choice offers valuable lessons. What matters is acting with courage and confidence in your abilities. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, does this decision align with my values and goals? If so, act with confidence, knowing that whatever the outcome, you'll learn something valuable. Remember, Courage and wisdom in decision-making not only help you progress, but also bolster your confidence in your ability to manage and shape your own life. 
11. Excessive Self-Criticism Many people set unrealistic standards for themselves and criticize themselves harshly when they don't meet them. Stoicism teaches that humans are inherently flawed, and making mistakes is part of learning and growing. Excessive self-criticism not only harms us but also hinders our personal growth. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, am I applying unrealistic standards to myself? If so, shift your perspective. Remember, view yourself with compassion and understand that progress, not perfection, is the true goal. This allows you to embrace your mistakes, learn from them, and grow stronger on your journey. 12. Falling into the comparison trap One of the biggest traps of undervaluing yourself is comparing yourself to others. In the age of social media, it's easy to get caught up in comparing our accomplishments, lives, and images to others. This not only diminishes our self-worth but also distracts us from what's important and meaningful in our own lives. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, am I living my life in a way that aligns with my values and goals? If you find yourself getting caught in comparisons, stop and refocus. Remember, everyone has their own unique journey. Comparisons only take away from your joy and confidence. Instead, celebrate your achievements and be grateful for your individual experiences. This will help you maintain your self-respect and live a more authentic and meaningful life. 13. Procrastinating on investing in your growth Another sign of undervaluing yourself is procrastinating on investing in your personal growth. Many people don't dedicate time, effort, or resources to learning new skills, pursuing hobbies, or taking care of themselves because they think they don't deserve it. Stoicism reminds us that every individual has inherent value and potential for growth and virtue. How to Reclaim Your Worth Ask yourself, am I investing enough in my own growth? If not, start by dedicating time to activities that help you grow, whether it's learning a new skill, taking a class, or simply taking care of yourself. Remember, investing in yourself isn't just about achieving new accomplishments, but about discovering and developing who you are. Your worth doesn't come from external validation, but from internal growth and fulfillment. The journey of valuing yourself isn't easy, but it's vital for living a meaningful and fulfilling life. Stoicism has shown us that our value doesn't lie in external factors, but in how we perceive and respond to life. As you begin to recognize and change the signs that diminish your self-worth, you'll find yourself becoming stronger, more confident, and happier. Remember, investing in yourself is an affirmation of your inherent value. Don't let fear or comfort hold you back from pursuing what truly matters. Every small step on this journey is worthwhile and contributes to a more fulfilling life. Be courageous, persistent, and always believe in your own abilities. You deserve the best.